What's going on, everyone? Welcome back. Let's continue on here with Dredge. Where'd we leave off? We completed the builder's quest there. We got her to her house or her little island. And she's constructing her house. So we ha now have a new place over there where we can rest. Um, we're still in search for relics. And everything else seems to be good. It's just the collector right now. Um, we got some nice upgrades, though. We're now rocking two engines. We just upgraded to this beefy refined outboard engine here. Um, I guess we can go over to Little Marrow and sell those gold pieces. Collect some fish while we're out there and look for some items for the collector. Oh, that's right. We need to go down here. Southeast. So that's actually going to be the goal right now. So let's... Go over to Little Marrow, we'll sell what we have, and then we are going down there. That is what we are doing today. Let's undock. Nice Sunday morning here at 6 a.m. I probably should have grabbed stuff from the crab pot, but sorry, I'm not too worried about it. Look how much faster we're going though, guys. I mean we're zooming. Let's go ahead and dock. All right, trader. Do I have some stuff for you? Oh, he gives us a book, the relaxed mind book. Sweet. Let's sell all that for sixty dollars. Beautiful. All right, let's check out the book he gave us. Let's go ahead and start reading it. Um, did it say? I'm not sure. I'm sure this will help us with our ins insanity meter, probably. Relax the mind. So, I mean, may that makes sense, right? All right. We are heading down here. So, let's just go out here to the left. We need to go about northeast, right? We'll just hold this angle. Should be able to get there. Oh, oops, didn't mean to do that. All right. We will stop for any gold glimmering, that pinkish, you know, relic glimmer. Uh, any dredge spots that aren't materials, although we could work towards materials. I'm not too sure what we want to go for now, though. Obviously, we want to upgrade the whole ship at some point, but... I should be using this, uh, I think. Looks like we can dock right over here. Are we almost here? We are. All right. We have arrived. Okay, we got some people we can ask questions for on where items could be. We will start with this resident here. Yeah. Inkfell resident, what is it? Do you need help with anything? Of course, yeah. Do you need help with anything? I've been trying to prepare a special meal for my partner, but I've been having some issues. Around here, we consider aged conger eels to be a particular delicacy. You may say they're rotting, but they're delicious if prepared correctly. Normally, we bury them in the ground and allow them to mature, but our dog keeps digging them up and eating them. <laughs> good for the good, good for the puppy, good for him. I can't raise the subject without spoiling a surprise. Can you bring me an aged conger eel? Of course we can. Thank you. You'll be decently compensated. All right. Anything else? Um, yeah, where can we find them? Ah, oh. oh, yes. They can be tricky to find. I'm told they inhabit the holes and burrows within the cliffs themselves. Oh, looks like we're going cliff fishing, guys. I imagine they've been fished out around the edges, so you may have to venture into the passageways of the cliffs to find them. Oh, and did I mention that they only come out at night? Oh, goody. Yes, I believe they hide during the day. Good luck. Anything else? 
Um, I don't know. Nah, I'm good on there. Don't need to know about the cliffs. Do you know of any odd characters around these parts? Nah. Maybe. Yeah, let's ask for that. Hmm. Have you heard the tale of McGran? He was an old whaler from these parts. As the whales got more scarce, the crew spent longer and longer at sea trying to find them. McGran, it seems, wasn't cut out for this. He informed an unnatural attachment to a scroll he found on one of these trips. He says the scroll told him how to become immortal by eating mutated fish. People started calling him McGran the Fishman, so he probably he probably went mad. One day, the town awoke to find all the boats, nets, and lines had been slashed in the night, and old McGran was nowhere to be found. Nor has he been seen since. Hmm. Guy's weirdo. All right. Nothing else then, miss. Well, what about the retired whaler? Mm. Uh, any shipwrecks? We'll probably ask him that one. Have you heard about any strange things in the area? About ink? Let's just uh, tell us about the shipwrecks. The real wreck around here is the settlement at Gale Cliffs. My brother ditched us and moved on over to those cliffs years ago. I suspect he's regretting his decision now. The devil. Anything else? No. Okay, wait. What did he say? What was that place called again, guys? Something again referred? Gale Cliffs. Gale Cliffs. Got it. Alright. Nothing. Unfortunately. Oh, we're here. We are at Gale Cliffs. So, we'll just do a perimeter check for the, the shipwreck. Looks like there's something here. Let's go ahead and remove this marker. We can head uh, up towards that point there. Oh, th this isn't even where we need to check in at, though. We need to go over to the right. Yeah, we'll do a little loop inside. Okay, good to know. We got to catch an eel. Boom, deliver rotting conger eel. Did it say what kind of... Uh, I would imagine I have the rod for it. Coastal. Hopefully it's a coastal. I would imagine, right? I mean, the cliffs are like right off the coast. All right, let's swing on over to this town, which is where we really need to be. Uh, I believe the collector wanted us to go over here, right? Looks like there's something on the inside there. Not sure if we can. Not sure how we get in there besides getting rid of these cliffs at some point, maybe. Hmm. An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. Oh, is, is this that dude's brother that we just talked to? That old guy over at the other uh, town? Ah. Oh, uh, greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is that you need? What is it that you need? This place doesn't seem safe. Why do you live here? I have been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I have been reconsidering my position lately. I've been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Now I'm alone and cut off by land and sea, left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. I could help you move. It's not that simple. My brother would never. You see, I used to live in Ingfell with my brother. Yeah, that, it definitely was that guy that we just talked to. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot, mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. We were in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest. I stole it from him. Now, after all this time... I can't return without it. Well, where is it? That's where the problem lies. After the collapse, that creature, it dragged debris from the house down into its wretch, wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. Oh, we gotta go dredge for it. It's a lost cause, I know, but if you were to find it, it's a large whalebone crest 
It would mean the world to me. I'll look for it. You got it. Thank you, but please be careful. All right. I didn't mean that. Whatever, we'll just rest. I did not mean to click rest, but we're committing. We're committing now. I meant to click research. Oh, we still need one part to get that. I was like, I thought we got this, but no. We are one part short, so. Um, okay. Um, I don't think there's any way we could get in there. I'm actually wondering. Right, let's go to research again. I'm wondering... Not too sure what mangrove is, but wonder if there's something, a rod that could get us over the the cliff here. Maybe not. Not too sure. Find the family crest. King Gale Cliffs. You got it. Hmm. So it's probably over there. Okay. What is it that we are looking for here? gotta be that guys but how do I get in there I think we might need something a pile of loose debris clearing this would take some strong explosives okay we need explosives to get in there Not too sure where we we're going to get some explosives, but um, let's go see if we can go get that family crest farm. Go through here. Get this way. Oh, get us out of here. What in the world was that, guys? It's seven o'clock. All right. That was like a very, very large eel, it looked like. Um, these fish look... Oh, we can't fish that. More... Cloth, it looks like. I thought we could get through there, but I don't think it will let us. All right, I think we have to go this way. that point the X on the marker on the map what is this should we get on that what is it oh all right don't touch those This looks like a shipwreck here. Um, I'm not sure what this would get us, but let's check for it. Oopsies. Oh, a research part. That's just what we needed. Ah, oh, yes, let's go in here. Here's where we need the dredge. See if we can find that old family crest of the whale bone. Oh, fuck! What's that? Your ship is dashed to pieces. You slip beneath the surface and join the unc- I just died? First death, guys. Yeah. 
fucking big eel thing, man. Wait, we're... Okay, so it's just where we slept from last time? We don't have that research part, though. All right, let's go get the research part. Is that thing gonna come out again? There it is, there it is, there it is. Drive! It wouldn't let me drive, guys. Oh, shit. Our boat is trash. What is that? In the gaps between the rocks, you can see what appear to be large white teeth. Damn, man. I really messed my ship up. I knew he was going to come out. I was just hoping we wouldn't take aggro or something and it would just swim on past, but... He, uh, he really damaged our ship here. Let's work our way around to that research part. I mean, what do you guys think I, uh, is it right here? No, that's just like a gold spot, and that's fish. Huh. What is this? An altar breaks through the waves at the base of the cliff. Three crab-like creatures are carved into it. The largest is covered in rocks and other strange shapes. I need something to put in here. Three crab-like creatures. I'm not sure what we need to put in there, but... We'll try to keep that in mind. Okay. It's this shipwreck right here. We need that research part. Yes. Here we go. Alright. Now the sketchy part. I He was at me real quick. So, we gotta try and avoid him here. Um, I don't want to dredge right away, I don't think. Let's just be ready to... Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. Go, 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 go. Go, drive, 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 drive. Don't hit that. Drive this way. Go away from us. How do we get him away from us, guys? We don't want to blow the engine. It is 7 o'clock. I guess we got to get out of here. Is this like his home? Did he leave us? What is that? We gotta, we gotta go back. We gotta go back and get out of here. Shipwreck here? I didn't realize it was this late, guys. Um. Okay. Man, there's something right here, though. We don't have time. We need to get back to safety, and we're going to keep our light off, so we don't want anyone, anything, to notice us. Can we cut through here, maybe? I think we can.
Should be somewhere that we can rest, like right here. Perfect. All right. That was crazy. We survived. We weren't able to um, dredge over there, though. And we can't repair our ship here. Zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. Um, let's just try. Oh, he's back. He's back. Uh, how do we, how do we, how do we do this, guys? We do not want to mess with him. I don't think he comes out here, though. Oh, he does. Will this thing get rid of him, maybe? If he swims over that? He's turning. Maybe now's our time. Alright, let's stretch for this gold item first. Here we go. Something's coming, huh? Grab it and go. I don't even know what we grabbed. Okay. Alright, there's the item. Right out there, guys. Jolly Noon. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Let's get out of here. Come on. Come blow the engine. Are we okay? There he is. I, I don't know if he's going to let us get this item or not. Okay, now's the time. We have to go now. He turned, he turned right. We have to go now. We got it, we got it, we got it. Come on. Oh, almost messed up. We're good. Come on. Let's go, we got it, we got it, we got it. Let's get out of here. Six o'clock. Boom, let's go this way. Check the map real quick. Do we cut in? I don't know if I remember being able to get through if we were to cut in there. So, let's just take our time. What is that? All right, there's, there's a, a dock right up here. Let's just send it. All right. Ooh. We made it a traveling merchant too. Ahoy there. You're a new face, a fisherman, I take it. Perfect. Well, we should get along like a house on fire. Haha. -ha. I'm a traveler and a merchant, all rolled into one. If you have any fish to sell, I'll take them on board and sell them at the next town I come across. Likewise, I haul a small cargo of equipment between places. You're welcome to pursue the stock and see if there's anything that takes your fancy. Come and see me when you're ready to trade. Um. Well, let's see what you got. On this side of the pontoon, I'll buy any fish you want to sell. I also keep a stock of crab pots here for sale. I think I'm good. So what did we grab? We got a pirate flag. Um, okay, so we can sell that to the gold merchant over at Little Marrow. Oh yeah, I don't have anything for you. Sorry, lady. Say, have you met the photographer? She stopped by my pontoon a while, a little while back. 
She's loaded up with fancy camera equipment to take pictures of all the wildlife. I wish I had my own camera. Wouldn't it be nice to be able to document everything you do? You'd never forget anything. Anyway, she said she was setting up a small island to the south of the Maros. If you're in the area, maybe you could check on her. Okay, we could definitely check on her. Can I, oh, can I repair my ship here? I can. Um, so I don't offload it, but come aboard and see what equipment I've got. Okay, cool. Yes, repair all, please. We took a beating. We could double engine this, guys. We don't have the money. All right, right now. Um, mm. you might be used to dry docks at other ports, but we can make the same upgrades to your boat here at this floating dock. Check it out. All right. I don't have anything for upgrades. Research, though, we can go ahead and get this. Flexible fishing pole. Let's put a point there. Mm. Okay. Buy that now. Ah. Boom, here it is. 460 bucks. Oh, guys, we got to make some money. We're not doing well on money. Okay. Oh. What should I talk to us about? Hey, again, come by for a chat. Do you need help with anything? <laughs> Assistance from an angler? Absolutely. I've been trying to collect records of where, <clears throat> of where each species of fish is located. I figured out most of them on my travels so far, but there are a few I haven't been able to track down. Reckon you could share your info with me? Sure. Great. The fish I have left to track down are Orfish Gulper Eel, Goliath Tigerfish. I want to catch the Goliath Tigerfish. That sounds like a fun, a fun catch. And, uh, I don't know what that word is, guys. Colactin? Colact? I don't know. I know a little about each species already, so maybe I could point you in the right direction. Mm. What did you want to know? Um, we'll just come across these as we as we go. All right, actually, tell us about tigerfish. The Goliath tigerfish. These guys are legitimately scary. They hunt in murky, swampy waters use, using the shade of trees as cover. All right, we're looking for some murky, swampy waters, guys. Oh, I guess, tell me about all of them. She's got no idea where these ones are, but they have a primordial feel to them. Or primordial. Or fish. So they're in deep, calm water. Maybe the shelter of Gale Cliffs would suit them. So, with, where that, where the, where the big eel that's trying to kill us is at? Gopher eels. They live in the deepest depths imaginable. You'll have to get some specialist gear to catch one of those. Okay. Ah, uh, let's rest. The boat's all fixed up. We got the upgrade. We just gotta make some money so we can buy that flexible rod. Looks like we got something out there in the middle. Let's go for that. Message in a bottle. Artifact manifest. Okay, just some information about some artifacts. 
Nothing too crazy. Catch the fish. Yes, let's go to the hermit and show him that we've received the family crest. We need some explosives too, guys. All right, mister. We got it for you. Hello again. What can I do for you? Is this your family crest? You found it. Never thought I'd see this beauty again. But now, I have a further favor to ask you. Would you take this to my brother at Ingfell? Tell him. Tell him his brother is sorry and would like to come home. That's sweet. They both miss each other. He's going to take it. He'll say absolutely. I would love my brother to come home. All right, Mr. Whaler. What is it? I believe this crest is yours. Gods, I haven't seen this since. Hmm. So he did take it. I knew it. Your brother's sorry. Will you let him come home? Hmm. I don't know if I was in a right state when he left. Okay, fine. He can stay in my old workshop at least for the time being, but I'll need some time to clear it out. While I'm doing that, perhaps you could do something for me. See, I've been trying to clear some debris in the pathways through the cliffs to make a shortcut with explosives. This is our guy. I was able to set a charge, but the cliff seemed particularly unsteady that day, so I didn't risk detonating it. You just need to get in there and set it off. It's not far in. I left some yellow flags nearby. Can't miss it. Is that those, uh, those things that look like teeth? <laughs> That he, when I inspected that rock over there. Anything else? Where did you say the explosives were? Mm. Head through the rock arch to the southeast. Follow the channel and you'll see the yellow flags on the right. Rock arch, southeast, flags right. Alright. Southeast. Oops, oops. Oops, done damage. Rock arch, there it is. Flags on the right. I'm actually not going to speed boost here. I feel like that might be what's waking up this big fucking eel. So let's just... Uh, no, he's coming back. He's coming back. He's coming back. Go this way. Ooh, nice try, mister. Oh, he's still coming. I didn't realize he was still coming. No, we're going to crash. Fuck. Oh, our engine's disabled. Oh, no, guys. I fucked our engine up. I fucked our engine up. Okay, I don't think he's... I don't think he's too mad at us now. How bad is it, miss? Oh, my God. It's completely disabled. Shoot. I think we can manage with what we got though. Let's go try it again. And the rock arch. Flags on the left. There are the flags. You think our horn would scare him off? We'll, we'll keep it ready. A long fuse trailing from one side. This must be the location. Yes. You light the fuse. I guess we just stood right there. That's crazy. Alright. Uh, I think one of the fish we need to catch for that lady are in there. I wonder if this guy will let us buy explosives from him. I also want to test our hypothesis that um, 
the foghorn. We'll get rid of that eel. Is he behind us? No. Guess we cannot park there. All right, before him, what is going on in the cabin? Okay, cool. We actually just completed the relax line. 10% resilient, resilience to panic. So that's cool. This is our panic meter. We are now, we now have 10% more resistance. That's good. Return to the whaling. Yep, we are here. Let's talk to him. You've done it. We heard the blast from here. Gods, the echo. I'm surprised the clips didn't come down on your head. I've got things ready here. Go and tell my brother that he can come home. Okay. I'll address. We are very damaged. Let's go tell this guy. Does this pause time? No. Right. Yeah, it is. So I can easily like switch to other things, like the speed boost if uh if the fog horn does nothing. All right, hop on my boat, Mister Hermit. Let me get you home. Your brother forgives you. Hop on my boat. He does? That's a huge weight off my chest. One so old, I hardly remembered it was there. <laughs> right, well, I'm packed and ready to go. We'll hop on. We're just, uh, partially damaged. What does this sound like, anyways? That's nice. Just let his brother know we're on our, we're almost back. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. All right. Well, here we are. Oh. Little brother, you're home. Hi. I'm so sorry. I was so foolish. We both were. Come on inside. Let me get your bags. The two brothers walk away down the dock. One of them pauses for a moment and turns back to you. Oh, stranger. If you find any more debris that needs clearing, I'm working on making some more packed explosives. My man. Come by the old whaling yards anytime. I'm gonna have to buy it from him, though. I wish he would just give it to me. Whaling yards. How much is it? Um. Hollowed out whale teeth packed with a powdery substance. A fused coil. A fused coil is up from the top. Hope you can put them to good use wherever you you find cause for it. Oh my god, he has a bunch. Oh, they're $40 after this one. Okay. Well, that's cool. We, uh, we got an explosive, which we can now go get that, that pinkish, uh, relic that's over at his brother's house. It's 10 a.m. Let's go do that. I don't want... Can we do it without that eel coming after us? I think we can. I'm gonna say maybe we go repair, but I think I'm gonna risk it. Let's go for it. I'm gonna switch the explosive here. No. Okay. 
Music is so nice in this game. Okay. Use explosives. Boom, baby. Let's get that item. Relic discovered. A rusted music box. So is that what, uh... Message. Artifact. Yeah, the music box. Purchased from the antiquarian at Little Marrow for a bargain price. Previously salvaged from a shipwreck. Okay. Well, we got one item for the collector. Two o'clock, we could rest here. Let's go ahead and dredge for this item. Oopsies. Let's go rest before that eel comes out and kills us. Actually, we're not going to do that. We're going to go repair and then rest. Just right over here. I'm sure we can make it. I'm sure we can make it. I'm not even worried. See? No problem. Oh, how much to repair us. Mm. 60. I'm running out of money. All right, we need to go make some money. Um, anything else around here? Besides, I mean, we got to catch the eel that's out here. I'm gonna make some money, but you can only catch the eel at night. There's that big one, man. It comes after us. I don't know how to get rid of him. We could try the foghorn idea now that we're repaired. That is a thought. Let's do speed boost for now. Because we know that he comes after us. Oh, wait, no, we don't know that. Foghorn, let's get that ready. Um, Let's check our pursuits real quick. Yeah, we gotta get the the rotting conger eel would be better to catch now. Because we're here. And one of these I wanna say maybe the gulper eel it was. No. Yeah. I think this was in swampy water. It could be the oarfish. This one she didn't know about. One of these two is uh, probably back in that debris field we just cleared. So we're gonna go that way. We gotta make some money. Oh. Oh, the dolphins are back. Or killer whales. From orcas. I'm gonna go with orcas. Those are pretty big. They were cute. All right, we cleared this path. We know he's gonna come out again. There's this little hole, you see it? He doesn't care. He doesn't care. Speed boost. We're out of here. Guys, he actually just does not care. Cut him off right here. 
We are faster than him. I think we might be faster than him. Just as is. Alright, he turned away. No way. We damaged it one. I didn't mean to do that. I just want to go in here and catch the eels. That I can only catch at night, though. A black mouth salmon? He's coming back. Well, we discovered a new fish. What fish is here? Oh, it's the same one. I think I have room for an eel. Should have plenty of room for an eel right there. Go back in here and wait till nighttime so we can get the eel. I could dredge that spot, that'll really kill some time. Let's do that. Let's put ourselves in a position where we can turn left or right depending on the way that that guy comes from. Almost seven o'clock. Hopefully we get a spot here soon by the cliffs. Maybe right up, uh, right up over here. Oh, those are, I can't fish for those. Are, they must be shallow, dude. Oh man. Those look like them too. Dang it. Well, let's turn our light on. There should be good ready. Let's head back. I guess we got some stuff to sell, so that's good. But we're gonna have to, uh... Get one more fish to sell. Well, that's a, that's a different fish. Nice. It was a trophy, too. We'll rest here. That's right. We needed a day where we could uh, catch a little bit of fish to sell. Go right on past me, please. Nothing to see here. Alright. Let's go sell this fish. Yep, sell all the fish. Um. 
this we'll do a loop here catch whatever fish these are oh wait and we also oops Just one more. We need to go. Man, that new rod is four hundred and some dollars. I guess let's fish and uh, get some money for it real quick. Or we could just grab our rod. Yeah, that's a lot of money. We might need to save it. So. Let's just quickly grab our rod. Put the oceanic up. Uninstall it. Put it away. Let's install this one. Alright. Will he bite fish? We now have coastal. Catch a few more of these. I like that the skill checks are uh, different. That is nice. Okay, four o'clock. This will actually work out being uh, pretty good. Let's go sell the fish here. This is an encyclopedia notification. Yes. Sell all the fish we have for eighty-eight bucks. And now, it's five o'clock. Let's start heading to the dangerous area here. <clears throat> Watch out for this guy as he comes out. There he is. All right, though. We know he's still behind us, I think. We'll just do like... Look this way, is he still coming? I think we're okay. We're looking for those eels. Oh, that rock came out of nowhere. Is he behind us again? It's so foggy. Here we go, here we go. There they are. Which one is this? This is the conger eel. That's what we wanted. Okay. Don't need the fish here anymore. What is this, though? Same. Okay. I was wondering if it was going to be that different fish for that lady that we need to get. Uh, which way? This way, guys? I think so. Something slithers into your cargo? Oh, no. That's right, we're almost here. Here we go. What slithered into my cargo? Oh, 
this one's infected. What's going on out here? Is that big eel? I think this is uh, the infected. Oh, something slithered into my cargo because this one's infect. Will it infect my other things or no? Let's just. I don't think it will. Should we just discard it to be safe? Because we're just gonna bring her rotting conger eels what she wants, and it's infected. I don't know if that's what. I don't know. Let's um let's hope it doesn't mess with the other eel. Just in case. Let's go on a rest. A silky stench rises from your cargo. Oh no. They're both infected. Hopefully that's okay. Let's go deliver them. If not, we may have to go out there again. Oh, she's not going to take him. Ah. Ah. Perfect. This will do wonderfully. I can offer you a small sum and thanks. It worked, guys. Infected. That's okay. that's that's great. 150 bucks, safe travels. Sweet. Okay, well then. Let's go ahead. I guess we can run with these two rods for now. We need to sell that before it gets bad. Sell it to this lady. Okay. All right. We got a decent amount of money from that. What are we doing now? Yeah, catch the rare fish, and then we're just still searching for relics. Let's go deliver this relic to the collector. Maybe he can give us uh, an idea on some other relics. Oh, right up over here. Is that his place? It might be. I think it might be a little further. I think it's that place right there. Yeah, it is. And we don't have Oceanic, and I would like to catch one of these. But I left our Oceanic rod. Darn. It's only 11 o'clock. Should we go grab it real quick? Come back out here for that guy? Okay, I kind of want, want to catch one of those. Like a swordfish or a marlin. Something like that. It will take some time to uninstall the equipment, though. Let's see what he says. So you've returned. I wasn't sure you were coming back. We give him the music box. You found this at the cliffs, didn't you? E yes. Ah, excellent. This should make future return journeys a little more swift. Allow me. He selects one of the silver ribbons trailing from the crimson bound book, opening it to some unseen page. Turning to catch the dim light, he whispers the words on the page. Ooh. After a few seconds, you feel your stomach drop suddenly as though thrown high by a wave. He closes the book and turns his attention back to you. 
Ability unlocked manifest. Instantly return to Blackstone Isle. Oh my god, that's perfect. Now, there are yet more relics to find. Keep looking. The reef at Stellar Basin may have caught and accumulated some wreckage. Search around that area. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? I think I'm good right now. So, I'll be able to instantly, like, teleport back here? Was that was that what he just did? Down here is our, the next place we gotta go to. Um, cool. Cargo. Have some of that stuff. Um... Oh, he tells us here. The other, okay, stellar base is next up for those. Wait, what'd this say? Oh, that's right. We could have looked them up in the encyclopedia, couldn't we? Well, let's... I'm not sure how the teleporting works, how we can get back here, but it would be a good thing to test out. So let's go ahead... Hmm, which one do we want to... Maybe we just hold on the coastal. Well, let's actually... Let's check the encyclopedia, right? What fish was it? Out of all the rare fish. There's oarfish, gulper eels. It wasn't... The, so oarfish and... Go, I think it was a gulper eel. Let's look up gulper eel. Here. Um, can I like search? I'm trying to find the gold reel, because she would have marked that in here for me, wouldn't she have? Do I need to go back to her and talk? I may need to go back and talk to her. I guess we can check all the pages. Why does it kind of show me the outline of this fish, though? Is this one of the ones she talked to me about? I don't think that's how it works. And I quickly scan. Not looking like him. Okay, uh, I might have to go talk to her again and get that information out of her again. I thought I was gonna, like, write it down in the encyclopedia to help me out, but... Done to be new to that, but guys, I think I'm gonna end this one here. We got a lot done in Gale Cliffs today. We got another artifact found for the collector. He's given us a, a hot tip on where the next one will be found. Which is over at, uh, Stellar Basin. So we can go there next. I kind of want to... Backtrack a little bit, maybe. Go back to Gale Cliffs and catch one of the rare fish, which I believe is one of these two. The ore fish or the gold creel. I'm a, 
probably go for eel. Because I think she said uh, that that place would be good for him. So maybe next episode we will go do that real quick before we head down to get this uh, artifact for the collector. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this one. I did. This one was uh, <laughs> this one was really fun with that whatever that big eel was that was trying to chase us. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this one, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!